Good morning, grade one. Good morning, lovely ones. How are you? You're excellent and you're amazing. You're so active. I missed you so much. Today, our lesson, it's similar to the last lesson, okay? It's like yesterday's lesson, but it's more composite shapes, okay? Now, you can uh, cut, again, some two-dimensional shapes. As we said, you can bring paper and start drawing two-dimensional shapes that are circle oh it's a half circle okay no problem circle you can also use half circles okay circles what is this circle i will draw it again okay this is the circle and square and triangle and rectangle and trapezoid okay and you can use also the rhombus shape or, or the diamond shape as you want. Okay, you draw it like this. Okay. Okay, okay. Now you have a lot of two dimensional shapes. You have a lot. You can draw a lot and start using them now to trace the shape you made. First, I want you to put two shapes choose two shapes from the one you did okay put them together stick them together let's say if you took um, triangle and squares put them together okay stick them together to combine them together combine them together to make a composite shape okay now put them together then trace the shape you made then draw a line in the middle of the both shapes to show your model okay then now i want you to put those patterns at the, those two pattern blocks it's not pattern you have no pattern you have the shapes that you cut okay i want you now to use the same shape that you cut in a different way okay and then trace the new shape you made then draw a line to show your model okay i'll do mine okay and then you can do yours i will use some from the shapes up i will use let's say a square okay okay then now i will take a triangle but i'm gonna change the color so to no okay this is the triangle i will put the triangle above it then what shape did i make hmm this shape oh i made a house great now i will take this shape again the both shapes i chose i chose the circle the square and the rectangle the triangle sorry and i will put the square here uh, i will use the triangle first i will put the triangle here okay and then i will put the square next to it okay it's look like an arrow okay now I did two, two composite shapes. This is the first composite shape and this is the second composite shape. But I used two dimensional shape. I used triangle and square. Again, I used the triangle and the square. You can do the same. Okay, choose another two dimensional shapes. Choose another two shapes. And stick them together and send me your work. Don't forget to send it to me. Then put a small star. Or when you send it to me, I'm going to put for you a star. Okay? This is page 667. Now go to page 668 now. 
it is very 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 funny picture uh, page and it's really nice you will love it hold your pencil and let's start solving this page together guided practice you can move pattern blocks around you have the one that you cut okay you can use them to make different composite shapes well see look at it guys i used the first one trapezoid this is the first shape and look at the triangle up i put them above each other and i what did i do i made a very big triangle i will use the same shapes the trapezoid and the triangle and uh, but now i put the triangle upside down okay and i put the trapezoid next to it now what is this shape see i had different shape now now i want you to go to the next example circle the pattern blocks used to make the composite shape then use the same blocks to make a new shape draw your shape the first one the first thing they said circle the pattern blocks used i'm gonna circle this and this okay i use this one and this one okay great now i need to go to the right side and draw the new one i will do now okay now i will draw the trapezoid first then i'll choose another color to draw the rhombus or the diamond shape okay how can i draw it i will stick it here okay then like this and then like this and like this see i made a very long trapezoid again see now i did this you can do another one and do it then send it to me now we're done with page 668 go to page 669 let's see what do we have here i will read for you quickly and you will do it alone hmm? use the pattern blocks shown to make the composite shape then use the same blocks to make a new shape draw your shapes okay you can see the pictures look at this triangle see which shape write how many shapes did you use even if it was for the same shape write how many and look at it has, you have a three questions to do alone do it and send me the page you saw go to the next page now okay go to question five okay now we'll read together edgar is making different shapes using these four pattern blocks draw one of the shapes edgar can make okay we will draw i can draw i have four triangles so what can i do i can draw one i can put them all together on one line one this is the first one i used it done i will go to use the second one okay green one okay i will put it upside down i'm done with the second one okay i'm gonna go to the third one okay i'm done with the third one now let's go to the last one i will put it next to it also upside down okay excellent great job now you can do another shape and also you can send it to me thanks for watching you're super grade one thank you so much i love you
bye bye